Okay. <sighs> I've recorded so much today. I am... I might actually take a nap. I don't know. The frigid gust of wind bellowed and welcomed into your lungs. The beauty of the falling snow failed to distract you from the chilling of bones. You had ascended to the snow line. Awesome. I am tired and hungry. Ah, oh, yes, it's the caveman again. Uh, wants four power, six hearts, three sigils. Oh, you know I'm gonna pick the sigils. Almost every single card we have has a sigil. That's why we're doing so good. Alright, let's see. The porcupine. Which, not bad, actually. Rattler, meh. Moose buckets. Yeah, we gotta go for the porcupine. Without a doubt. I love my sigils. What kind of sigil is this? We we desperately need backpack stuff. Hey, bone coins. I don't need a black goat. Uh, the fan does help a little bit. A squirrel. Oh no, it's time for the thing where you do the thing and the thing does the thing and oh no, a bunch of the meese are stinkies. Which honestly, that kind of adds up. Okay, so we got GG, which is actually pretty good because that's a no cost card. Let me see what we got. Okay, so. Yeah, that one's stinky, but it has seven hearts. An empty space would be struck. Okay, so that's good, actually. Um, still would honestly cancel it all out. Uh, let's put GG here. Uh, I'm going to put my squirrel there, summon the elk fawn there to do a little bit of damage, and then I'm actually going to steal another squirrel, put that down to make that a stoat. And look at that, we won. It's so, like, when, when you spend so much time just losing, it feels so invigorating to finally win. Yeah, your pets are the finest. Oh, that is a lot of teeth. <laughs> so much teeth. Uh, yeah, we don't have six teeth. Okay. That's a lot of pelts, honestly. So now we just have to find the person that buys the pelts. Okay, let's see. Which one is the least helpful? Um, honestly, the magpie has to be the least helpful just because it takes two bones. I mean, uh, two blood. Oh. No. I don't want to do that, actually. Um, I got to give GG the additional ability to get me a card. And fly, so that's like 18 skills in one. Also, welcome back to the description. I don't know if I said that. My, my name's Chronicle Blue. Hello, Sleepy Bears. Uh, <laughs> okay, the Golden Pell doesn't do anything. So we've got a squirrel. Let me see what we're up against. Okay, an egg. Two eggs, actually, and a porcupine. Oh, and a spider, apparently. Um, we got one attack. Which, that's good. But that'll only lower the power. I'm gonna put you right here. Okay. We can live without something. Okay. There's no... Yeah, no, there's no blood there. Um, that's bones. That's flying. So yeah, we're gonna have to knock that raven out. Okay, cool. We lost. So glad we had a great streak going. Um, that's okay. That's okay. really don't like any of these. Um, 
I guess the elk, just because it has, like, good health. I don't think we've seen this mushroom before, though. You find yourself among a cave, a grove of thick and pungent mushrooms. You squinted to see a figure through the thick cloud of spores. We are the mycologists, yes. Yes. And we are performing our experiments far from, from, well, we are not welcome anywhere else. We will experiment on your flock, yes. We will need two of the same creature, one for each of us. Uh, sure, I guess, why not? Uh, this could get messy, look away. The rabbit pelt is now one. Thanks, I guess. It's not that helpful, but whatever. Okay, let me see here. Mole man. Hey, right, what are we up against? Raven egg, porcupine, raven egg. Huh, a lot of the same. Now that's one damage, but that has two hearts. All right, let's put the squirrel down. The mole man will, at the very least, help us like, get out of the sticky situation. Okay, that's good. I'll go ahead and put the bullfrog down now. Okay, that... Reginald, my man. How you doing? I want to get rid of that raven. Um, gotta say, though, it's not looking good. Another pelt. You gotta be kidding me. Um... The only thing we can do is make it fly. Or to try to like wait, if he has the instant death, if he attacks him directly, do we win? No. Awesome. Having fun. Having having so much fun. Well, if we get to choose the cost, I'm definitely going to do the Golden Pelt. The power and health. Not a lot here, so I guess we'll do 1 plus 2. And now for the Sigil. Um, This one has double, why not? This one will be called Last. If I die one more time, it is the end of the Let's Play. Because I had like a really good streak, but now I'm just like, you know what? Whatever. Okay, I'm, I'm losing it. Yes, I know we still have the roll. Is that a fishing hook? He was defeated recently and he wishes to redeem himself. It would be unfortunate if you were to fail the prospect before he was given that chance. This hook is powerful. You may steal one of my cards with it. For that reason, you will not find any others along the path. Use it wisely. Okay, we still have our deck. Um, let's go blood, why not? Uh, one blood, please. Campfire to strengthen a card. For plus one power. Yeah, yeah, yeah whatever. Beehive, are you kidding me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do it again. Do it again. 
honestly, just getting the beehive up to three, that's pretty good. Salutations! Now the beehive requires one blood, which I am quite alright with. We don't have enough for the stink bug yet. It looks like we made a good move with that, too. I'm gonna put that down. Put the stilt there. You can say keep you alive all you want. It's not really gonna help. And because he has zero damage, he can't actually attack. So we won that one. If I could... Okay, so random card. Oh yeah, just random card, I guess. Elk, wolf, worker, ant. I guess we will go with... Uh... The wolf. Woodcarver. Again, it's only a squirrel. What does that do? An opposing creature is placed opposite to empty space. I guess we do flying. Flying squirrels are always fun. Time for a battle. Salutations. Okay, um. Who are we up against? We got a stonk and a sparrow. Uh, let's see. That does one damage. So. How much health is it? Two. Okay, that's good. Now, I'll take that skunk out. Put that haunted wolf there. Because then the wolf can actually murder. Not murder. Yeah, because the skunk doesn't do any damage, so that's good. Yeah, we gotta grab a squirrel. I'm gonna wait. Put that there. Put the wolf there. Stink bug there. That will definitely help us. Bullfrog, perfect. Lots of teeth. So I think what I'm doing wrong is I keep picking... Uh, I keep getting way too many pelts when it comes time to get pelts, because I, I just really want to see the reward. And I feel like that's it. I feel like that is the real issue there. Sure, I'll do a moose, why not? A flying moose, flying niece, if you will. I have this insect that is flying around me, but I really, I'm too focused on not dying. Because again, this is the final episode. If I die, then it's over, because I, I cannot, I cannot keep having the same conversation. Okay, so we need something with at least more than one health in order to take that out. So I'll take that down. Put you there. And that's where we're gonna have to take it. Oh, that's right, it's swimming, okay. Beehive's good. That's just the attack. Um, I'm gonna have to break my squirrel. Because I really want to get that, like, triple attack right there. And I'm gonna put the stink bug there. There we go. Death cards. Okay. The one to one is all right, I guess, but you can't beat a no cost card. Whoa.
Woodcarver. Yeah, you want to give me something that's not that... Like, a bird. That would be something, I guess. I think we have insects. I think that's a wolf. So yeah, I'll do a wolf that can fly. And remember, we have to be careful about how we do this, because if we put way too many cards, then he'll turn them into gold. A flying wolf is so pretty good. What do we got? That's right, we got the coyote and the mule. Okay. Coyote only has one heart, so that's really good. So that means we could take care of it pretty fast. And the greater smoke would work, but we'd have to take the blood of something else. So we got a B, so that's good. Okay, that that's really good, actually. I'm going to put that down there. Play the wolf the wolf and that'll be enough to take him out so we can extinguish one of his flames get another flame going okay good I was looking at the clock and it seemed like it was freezing but thankfully with this it's also really good because it means that we could put down the stink bug definitely for that and then we could put down the B here to just to do subliminal damage. Yes, that's good. And then, honestly, just due to the health of that? Okay, so that does one attack. Alright, so I might as well get rid of the squirrel to put the coyote out of its life. And yeah, yeah, I know the dog's gonna attack, but that's fine. Got the KC, which does left and right, which is really good, but it only does one attack, but so does the bullfrog. But by putting that here, it does two attacks. Pretty close, pretty close. Oh, I'll grab a squirrel, why not? There we go, we won. And if this episode is like 40 minutes long, I'm sorry. I, I'm... Like, th this is it. Like, if I lose, that's it. I, I can't keep doing this. Um... I guess the amalgam, just because it's only two blood, and no matter what creature it is, it still works. It will still get the effect of flying. Like, at this point, I'm hyper-focused. Like, I can't... Eight bones? You gotta be kidding me. What did that do? When a card bearing the sigil is played, a dam is created on each empty adjacent space. A dam is defined as zero power to health. That would help us if we need to collect, like, a bunch of squirrels for whatever reason. Now, that'd be good. That's the wood carver. I forgot what this one is. Is that where we sell pelts? No, 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 we kill a card. Okay, what do we not need? Um, honestly, if I could get that dam builder. Oh, this that's right, this is where we just kill a card. To get bones, okay, never mind, never mind. My bad, but it's fine. Get an extra bone. Like a draw. Alas, we meet again. And you fly now, so that's cool. Hey, okay, what's up ahead? It's a bullfrog, that's super easy to take care of. Okay, well let's go ahead and put this down here. You do one damage, you do two, so I wanna put you right here.
Yeah. And then we win. Yeah, because it only needs five to win. So if, it, it's a, if it's always our first turn, then no matter what, as long as we do something right, then we'll be awesome. We don't really have a choice. We can only go to the campfire to increase the health. Okay. Um, what can I increase the health of? Honestly, if I can increase the health of this car, that'd be really good. That's pretty good. I'll do another one though. Okay, I'm 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 good. Just getting a no cost card to six health, even if it has no attack, that's really good. Okay, so let me see here. So that's good. Now let me see here. It's a bee and a bullfrog. You do two health. It only does one damage, that's good. Yep, got to, gonna do that. Yeah, the bee's flying, so it doesn't really do a whole lot, but that's fine. Uh, we gotta get a squirrel. Don't have a whole lot there. But we can put it right there. That'll take care of it. Yeah, there's the bee gone. Corpses are in no short supply. Um, sure, I'll grab another squirrel. So that way we can summon the amalgam. Ah, that mantis doesn't do a whole lot. Got a stoat, which, again, doesn't do a whole lot. Yeah, you have, like, one damage, so, meh. Amalgam's really good. That's definitely going to help us. But, um, I guess I'll take the mantis. Just because it's better to mitigate how much damage you take. Another flying wolf, so that's good. Uh, I'm just curious now. What happens if I, like, use the knife when we're at, like, the halfway point? Oh, it's a, is that an automatic win? No, it's just most of a win. Well, still. There we go. And yeah, we're going to want the fancy eye. For whatever reason. So, random card. Random card. Random card. Well, if we go over there, then we'll have to face the twisty turny thing. But if we go over here, then it will just be a bag. Random mantis or turkey vulture. I like the mantis. I really do. Okay, we are going to get bones and a squirrel. Those are really helpful. Lucky draw, a stunted wolf that flies, and a regular wolf. Okay, so we got ant, ringworm, ant. So that's good. I'm gonna go ahead and put that there. Put the stunted wolf here, because it can fly. I'm gonna put the stink bug. It would have it would have one attack actually. Okay, yeah. That's fine, that's fine. You'll live, you'll live. Put that right there. Okay, that's less fine. Ah, uh, yeah, my man. Well, because of this three attack, 
Let me see here. I want to put that there, because that in and of itself will kill the mantis. Yeah, that's four. Of course, not going to do a whole lot, but that in and of itself, so that's three, four, five. I was still a bit behind. So if I grab a squirrel, because these both have the same, and that has three, I gotta put that there. There we go, there we go, there we go. Onto the bear trap. Yay, first one's free. I can't get nine, so I'll just get the wolf pelt, and that'll be it. Too many pelts is a bad thing. You gotta be really careful with your pelts. Okay, so for this one, is this the death one? No, okay. This is the give them a sigil. I gotta give the double attack to someone. Let me see here. Oh, that would be like an automatic win right there, as if I did that. Oh, that that actually is an automatic win. I'm ready to take names. Like, for real. And this is the Fisher. We got him. We got him. That's how good it is. Right at the very beginning, too. Sweet goodness. Oh my. Yeah, that, that's an automatic win. Like, I don't care what you say. That... I gotta put that right there. Like, there's no other way to do it. Look at that. Yeah, and then there's just one card there. We don't even have to do anything. I mean, like, I'll do something anyway. Because why not? Like... Dang. The fact that we are doing so good now. Like, I think I just became really smart. I think that's what happened. That one apple I ate as a snack, that, that gave me the brain power I need. Amoeba. The sigils are ever-changing, okay? But Child 13 can never die, so we can always use it as uh, the thing, so that's good. Let me pass the pond. Okay, let me see here. I'm gonna go to this right one, because I don't know what's there. Ah, a pelt buyer. We could get a grizzly, a river otter, otter. Let's see, a rabbit hole. When a card bearing the sigil is played, a rabbit is creating a hand. A rabbit is defined as zero power, one health. That's not that great. Um, how about I do a cat? Ooh, <laughs> I like this. A flying cockroach that can never die. Wow. Okay, well, I don't, I'm all attacking both directions. It doesn't do anything. But a flying cockroach, that's something. Plus it's four bones. I knew those pelts would come in handy. We just had to be careful with them. A powerful item. Turn this and I'll skip my turn. 
We gotta get that. Especially with this one coming up. Okay, so all mice. If we attack, it does one damage to us. And we got the winner. I don't even know how it happens. I really don't. Um, I gotta use the bones. I, I really don't feel like fighting him. I really don't. Not even a little. It's not much. But it still does a lot of damage. So we gotta get the stoat. And then I really want to get rid of this thing. There we go. It's that easy. It's that easy. If you just think smart and play smart, you'll be smart. Uh, I'll take Lewis. Why not? Okay. We do need something for the backpack because we just use an item. Uh, bones. That's exactly what I want. And then here, after this battle, we can choose what we want to do. We got the winner again. Ah, my man. He knows how I like it. Okay, let's see what's up here. Elk fawn. Okay, well, that's super easy. Um, we're going to put that there. Put the mantis right there. Because that is super, super easy. And that'll do two. And then with that one, that one will actually get us the win. Because it'll be like one tooth, nothing. That will attack that one. So put that there. Put the stoat right there. That'll be good. So yeah, it became an elk now. But that is, that's fine, honestly, that's fine. Gonna get rid of that, put that right there, and we're gonna win. It's just that easy, it's just that easy. Really don't feel like doing a campfire or another totem thing. So I'll take a one blood. Ooh, that one that one's attack increases based on how many cards we have in our hand. All full, but pack crab. And good, 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 good. Extra bone. Got a flying wolf. Got a cat that we can always give up. That's really good. Let me see what's up here. Elk fawns. That's that's all right. That's not bad. Uh, I gotta give up the squirrel. Put the cat down. Thankfully, that doesn't do anything. But we can put the beehive down. We're gonna call that good. I mean, hey, we got a bee. Uh, yeah, let's grab another squirrel, because I know that we need one. Kill the squirrel, kill the cat. Put that there. Put the bee right here, and that'll take us to victory. Bam! Bam! That's how good we are. I I'm a sucker for my free bees. I really am. I won't allow you to take more items. And there's Stead. Take this. It's another pack rat. Now we're on a boss that we have not done before. And don't forget, we still have that hook if things go sour. A man stood before you, a man you recognized immediately. It was the Trapper. You reached out to examine his wares, but he stopped you. Sorry, but today you will supply the pills. Oh, that's a lot of knives. My goodness. Got a flying wolf. And the flying cockroach. 
strange frog and leaping trap. What does that do? When a card bearing the sigil perishes, the creature opposing it perishes as well. A pelt is created in your hand. Hmm. Let me see here. Um. That doesn't have, okay, that does have damage. That, that's fine. Um. Put that there. And the, the flying cockroach. Well, it's good. It can't die, right? Yeah. When it dies, a copy is made, but it, it's that's only through bones. That's the attack. Uh, I'll do that. And then I'll do a flying cockroach here to get rid of that. And then I really want to go ahead and grab that leaping trap. It's not much of a lead, but it's something. So we got the cockroach, that's good. Let's see what else we get. The stunted wolf, that's really good. Thankfully, it only requires one blood. But we don't have that exactly. Let's grab some bones. Put that right there. And then actually, I'm going to skip his turn. Yep. But with those, that means that we will automatically die there, which is not good. Um, but we do still have that one trap right there. But that's okay, because the cockroach never dies. I don't think a cockroach is a wolf, but okay. Then we have one bullfrog there, which honestly completely fine. Yeah, I know that we need a squirrel. We can put the cockroach right there. Put the squirrel down here. Sunted wolf right there. And that will definitely help us there. There's an elk coming up, which is fine. Ah, I can't wait to use you. But I think we have exactly what we need. There we go. Halfway there. I'm sure he's gonna do some stupid thing. Powerful cards, I will only accept the finest pelts for them. Trade for what you can, but know this, the rest will stay and fight for me. Oh man. I gotta grab that grizzly. That river snapper won't do too much. I know that's insta death. Honestly, I feel like if I could just grab all of his grizzly. Oh, that one has the insta death and the two fur. I would have chosen differently. I'm sure you would have. Okay, so we have a bunch of good cards. That elk won't do too much. That Adler is just an insta death, so if we could get rid of that, that'd be really good. Yeah, we're gonna do that actually. But now that we got that river snapper gone, that's really good. So we have two squirrels, an uh, insta-death that attacks diagonally but only does one damage, but that's fine. Okay, let's put two squirrels here, and I'll do a grizzly to get rid of the squirrel, the cockroach, and this squirrel. 
put that grizzly there, and should it continue, I put my cockroach right here. There we go. Your lives are restored. Perhaps one of these will entice you. Orboros, Amoeba, the Dawes. That filthy feral hog, it becomes incensed when its chimes are struck. What does it do? When a card bearing the sigil is played, a chime is created on each empty adjacent space. Chime is zero power, one health. Yeah, that's good if we need something, I guess. With the enigmatic trapper and traitor now bleeding into the snow, you persisted. You could see a light in the distance. The end is near. We will need another map. Is this the final map? My goodness. Okay, well that one, that's trading pelts. And we have a lot of pelts, so we should really do that. Post was left for banners and respect for the strange woman. You took only what you can afford. I don't think we really took anything there. Your eyes have fixed themselves on the small cabin. It's warm light, a beacon in the, in the oppressive darkness of the night. Surely, surely this cabin marked the end of your tri tribals. Steps away from the strange cabin, you were presented with an opportunity. I don't offer my boons to just any traveler. If you're able to pass my trials, you will be rewarded mightily. The trial of the thinned. The three drawn cards must include a card with a waterborne sigil. The trial of the three skins. One card must be a pelt card. The trial of the ring. If you have a ring, you pass automatically. A ring. Uh... We don't have a ring. I'm almost certain one of ours would be able to... No, actually, no, they won't. So I guess we have to go with the pelt. But no, we just traded the pelts. So I guess swimming. Pack rat, beehive, the Dawes. Not a single waterborne sign. Failure. We repeat that once more. Okay. Airborne, I know I got. I know I got an airborne. Failure. Okay, whatever. I'll continue. Oh, hello there, sir. You didn't get any boons? This won't even be a challenge. You took your time out there, and I'm itching for another game. Are you ready to play? I guess. I hope you are adequately prepared. Good as smoke. Perhaps one more to be safe. Ah, oh, what? No fair. That's cheap. Okay, let's see here. Mole Man. Mentis cards, okay. That one's not bad. Um, bit of smoke will give us bones. Put that there. Put that there. That there. I'll kill the squirrel to put the cat down. And I guess I'll kill the cat to put the car down. Ah. 
to get rid of two, thankfully. So I can do so right there. really won't be any help here. Which fish? Hard to choose. Really? You made it so far. What about the camera roll? I still have the camera roll. Your death card, beautiful. What am I doing again? I, I forgot. Wait, I guess I bounce. Power and health. Let's do th three and three. Now the sigil. Let's do the cat. I meant what I said. I hope you enjoyed the long episodes and my constant failure. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. Goodbye, all of my sleepy bears. And if you like Inscription, you can go ahead and try it. It takes quite a bit of time to understand it. And even then, uh, may the cards ever be in your favor. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. I will see you all next time. Goodbye, my sleepy bears. You're telling me. Per you, I cannot give up on this game. I have to finish it. Is that what you're saying? A thousand percent, yes. L a little closer to the mic, dear. Not that close. There, go. A thousand percent, yes. You cannot give up. I have to keep going. Yes. And this just might be a game where I spend 80 hours on it and never finish it, and you're okay with that? Yes. Okay. There we have it. I can't give up. So I'll see you all Tuesday. You, you can thank the husband for this.